Hello guys, this is Mauro from Primfotech.com and on this video we'll look at the new features and changes included on Windows 10 build 17040. This new test version of Windows 10 is part of the uh, next feature update due in 2018 which currently we know it as the uh, Redstone 4 or version 1803. Now let's have a closer look at the most worthy improvements in this release. On the uh, settings app, when you go to system and on display if you have an HDR display, you will now be able to adjust the uh, brightness for SDR content. I don't have an HDR monitor to show you that feature, but I can show you a screenshot from Microsoft that shows how the uh, new slider looks, uh, looks like on your HDR monitor. On build 17.040, now apps that has been registered to restart after a reboot or shut down no longer will start automatically unless the uh, user specifically comes to the uh, sign in options section and turns on the use my sign in info to automatically finish setting up my device after an update or restart option on easy of access the uh, cursor pointer and touch feedback page is new and it includes the options to change the, uh, the cursor thickness, the pointer size and color and change the uh, touch feedback settings. Also on build 17040 you will no longer find the others option page anymore. On privacy you will now find a new activity history page that includes all the data that Cortana uses for pickup where you left off and it is also the place that you can delete this data. As a result of the new activity history page, now when you go to the Cortana section, you will see many of the settings missing in Talk to Cortana and Permissions and History. So we're gonna have to wait until let it builds to see how the settings will look like for, for version 18.03. And that's pretty much all that's new with the uh, settings app for Windows 10 build 17.040. In this release of Windows 10, Microsoft is also improving the uh, touch keyboard experience to include support for shape writing in the uh, full size keyboard mode. So as you can see now you can use shape writing to write with this uh, keyboard mode. Previously it was only available on the one handed keyboard but now it's been expanded to the wider experience. Also build 17040 the uh, handwriting experience now includes an improved gesture to add a space in between letters. And also the, uh, the panel now will commit the written text by drawing an angle of 90 degree. And that's pretty much all that's new on Windows 10 build 17040. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.